Hi, my name is Grace Ellen Hopkins and I'm here for Brother Drum Carter and I'm going to be making hand pulled roving from a bat on the standard drum carter. This is a manual drum carter and it requires very little force and has excellent give. The mechanisms are on the inside. You do have to be a little bit careful for this right here, so make sure when you're carting you keep the fiber inside these teeth. These soft spots right here keep them inside. It's much easier to card multiple smaller bats than it is to pick fiber out of that little piece. We're gonna lay down a layer of roving. That makes it really easy to pick off the bat. No matter what kind of texture you lay in after this roving, the roving acts as kind of a barrier. This one here, it's got major chunks of color, but when you blend it, it smooths out and makes it a really nice semi-solid. Here, right now, I mean on this side it's a little better, but not, so this is not great. Just to pull off the main section of the pink and card it by itself so you have really nice control of that. The main section of the green. And again, nice control. Another trick is don't pull on this when you're carding or else it's going to loop around like that. So if it's too fat, you can draft it out when you're not carding. Uh, I also pinch right here to keep it from going over to this side and that helps it keep pretty close to the edge but not at the edge. It's here. Right in there. And you can see how that's made a really smooth transition right there. Nice. Okay, now we're gonna start building the art portion of it. Normally I hook the handle around my hip like this. Now if you have the motorized drum carters, you don't have that worry, they just stay firm. All right, so to do this, we pick a little bit of an end and I have a crochet hook and a wide cake right, decorating tip. So you hook it, pull it through, and then you let the drum swing back, gently pull it up. Now if you feel like you have too thin of a roving, you can go in between the teeth here and pick a little bit up and shove it in there. And it'll catch on the next go. The hardest part is having the coordination to keep this out of the way of getting tangled in the teeth, plus moving the handle. Now if you're having trouble having it jump to the next section, 
which I almost always do, <laughs> you can just, again, put a little in there and that'll help it go through. But don't put too much or else you'll clog your tip. And once you get going, you'll be able to go. Uh, another tip is to kind of hold it in the direction you're wanting it to go. So I want it to go that way. So I'm gonna try and tilt the back in that direction. Hand pull roping on a Brother Drum Carter. And again, this is the standard drum carter. And we have several other videos, including on the motorized drum carter and the baby for all kinds of different tips and techniques. So check those out and I will see you next time. Bye.